Okay, so this, uh, the individual who actually started this whole dispute on uh, the Officer Tatum's channel, um, tried to come to my channel and got upset because I'm pro-life. Now, my question is this. Why would you post about killing your child at 23 weeks? And talk about having an abortion at 23 weeks. And then expect people who are pro-life to have an opinion on that that is not positive. It doesn't make any sense. I don't understand why you're obsessed with my opinion on being pro-life. That's all I'm talking about in this video. I've always talked about the same thing here. That I'm pro-life. That I think that abortion is taking someone's life. Ending a human's life. It is. It's ending a heartbeat. It's stopping a heartbeat. It's killing someone. Um, that's what pro-life people think. You know, I don't understand. I get tired of people expecting pro-life people to be fake pro-lifers. Some of us are real pro-life people. We don't believe in exceptions, you know. And this person, by the way, is not even one of those people. Because those people do act very entitled. And I was addressing some of those people who believe that people should accept their abortion and them killing their kids because they were raped or issues like that. I specifically um, addressed some of the um, commenters. I even um, tagged them. But this one specifically did not. This one was specifically someone who had an abortion at 23 weeks, which many people who are pro-abortion have an issue with you having an abortion at 23 weeks. They, they don't like it either. And you expect me to be okay with that. I mean, I'm not okay with anyone killing their kid at any time. But you specifically uh, had an abortion at 23 weeks. And because you said you were, you stopped being engaged or somebody dumped you or something, um, you decided to kill your child. Um, that's not me being negative. Um, I'm just addressing basically why people like you were having a fit in the comment section there for me being pro-life in a specific sector where we're conservative. Did you not know what the Officer Tatum's channel is about? He is conservative. He is pro-life. You know, he's even tried to touch upon the um, heart cases in some cases. Um, he's not for abortion, okay? He's just not for abortion. And so then, like-minded individuals, since he has a big platform, he has like 2 million people there, like-minded individuals support his channel. And because of this, many of us share the same views as him, and many of us are very pro-life as well. So you shouldn't be shocked when you see people who are pro-life. Now, the thing is, also on top of this, it wasn't just like that... Uh, I brought up being pro-life out of nowhere. We're literally doing a video. I mean, we're not, but we're watching a video um, on a on him talking about a woman who they were basically a pro-life organization was trying to um, inform what an abortion was and show her what an abortion actually was. So we are talking about our pro-life stance and trying to get more people to understand why you should be pro-life, you know, why it's killing a human life, you know? And so it's like, it's not like it's out of the norm. It's not out of the norm. It's not like I was bringing it up out of nowhere. I was bringing it up because this was the topic, but you thought to start stuff by trying to post about having an abortion at 23 weeks and expecting people to try to support you in that because you said that you felt pain, like we were supposed to feel sympathy for someone having an abortion at 23 weeks because they were feeling pain. Uh, like as if the child didn't feel any pain. You understand you didn't lose a life. 
the child lost his, their life and they felt a whole lot more pain than you ever could imagine feeling and of course i understand you don't care but don't under don't you understand that obviously i do and that pro-life people do care so i don't understand why you would be mad at the comments why are you mad at the video because it's like at this point there are plenty of other people asking you the same question. Even people who are, I guess, more soft and not ready to um, speak their opinion. Because a lot of pro-life people are shunned and told not to speak on their issues and stuff. And you were mad at me and trying to get mad at me for speaking how I feel about abortion. And some other people were questioning you as well. You know, of course, because th it's a platform for people who are pro-life. So, I mean, you shouldn't be shocked when you get criticism from people who are pro-life. When you say that you had an abortion and killed your kid because you you were dumped by your fiancé, basically. Um, a lot of pro-abortionists, pro-abortion people would be against you, too, for having an abortion at 23 weeks and um, because your fiancé dumped you. You know, that that's just the truth. So, I mean, like, you shouldn't be mad at me for that. But now, the other thing what I want to talk about here is you trying to say that my um, videos were fake or whatever. No, I'm a real person. I'm right here. My, um, I show my face well, plenty sucks. of times. I was trying to tape all that time, and it did so, as you can tell, I do um, do live videos of myself. I um, specifically have shown my face since uh, 2020. Every year, I always show videos of myself. Now, yes, I do talk on screen and just watch, basically. But... I do show myself uh, every now and then. 